story, Mike Stern, and he likes to eat wooden baths. The small wooden bath. He likes to eat wooden baths. And it has a blue spot on him. And also wild dingoes. In 1860. Probably really hard for the Cameliers when they had to pray at night and stuff. Because today it was like 45 degrees. And now it's still like 40, 41. And at night it's probably going to be like 30. And imagine how hard it was for them when they had to come and pray every day. Murray, the centre of Afghan activity in Australia, has the longest surviving Gan town. Still living there are the descendants of Khan Zada, Musha Balush, Dadle Balush, and Mullah Asim Khan. Each Afghan community had its own leader. In Udinadatta, it was Abdul Qadir, and in Mari, it was Berja Darwish. Berja was born in 1862 or 1867 in Makrain, Baluchistan and died in 1957 in Port Augusta. Prior to his arrival to Australia, during his military service, he attained the rank of sergeant, serving in the Indian Army at Kandahar and Karachi. He arrived in Australia in 1891 and settled in Mari, where he bought land in 1902. He played a key role in the 1896-1897 Calvert expedition with explorer L.A. Wells. His oldest son, Abdul Jabbar, or Jack Beja, accompanied Madigan's 1931 Simpson Desert expedition. Beja's name is preserved in Beja Hill, on the edge of the sandy desert. So named by the explorer L.A. Wells on the 22nd of August, 1896, after the faithful Beja. Beja is commemorated by a plaque on the Jubilee 150 walkway in Adelaide as one of 150 people who made a major contribution to the development of South Australia. Last of the lords of the desert, who carried out food and water on a string of 50 camels. Old Bijar de Verish, the giant Afghan, who fought the desert by compass and by Koran. It's hot here in Kupapedi, but it's not as hot as in Marie and Unadata. And we finished the 700 kilometers of off-road and we're heading towards the Northern Territory.
For example, they help they helped build the railways. They carried goods. And, and they explored inland. They explored inland, yes, Zach. Um, it's and fascinating and amazing the yes, contribution of them. Somehow, uh, Australians tell us to come back to where we came from. And that's just that, that's not a good thing to say, especially when we contributed to Australia. Just brought in the thunder, and the men they followed in the land down under. Follow the journey you tell, passed into legend From the desert to the land of morning crescent Wives, but still they strived and worked around the clock From rocks to cement, shipping all kinds of stock Not treated as equals, but they don't stop They come to love the land, they began to adopt The culture of the natives, all the lows and highs They got married, made friends, built stronger ties Afghan and Aboriginal, the bond was true just like the baby Joey and mother kangaroo The love and respect, they all just banned